as soon as all had ate and the elder ones paid. The carriage was ordered, and after some contrivance, the whole party, with all their boxes, work bags, and parcels, and the unwelcome addition of Kitty's and Lydia's purchases, were seated in it. How nicely we are crammed in, cried Lydia. I'm glad I brought my bonnet, if it is only for the fun of having another bandbox. Well, now, let us be quite comfortable and snug, and talk and laugh all the way home. And in the first place, let us hear what has happened to you all since you went away. Have you seen any pleasant men? Have you had any flirting? I was in great hopes that one of you would have got a husband before you came back. Jane will be quite an old maid soon, I declare. She's almost three and twenty. Lord, how ashamed I should be of not being married before three and twenty. My Aunt Phillips wants you so to get husbands, you can't think. She says Lizzie had better have taken Mr. Collins, but I do not think there would have been any fun in it. Lord, how I should like to be married before any of you.